got another one. What happened to it, Jason? I broke it. Jason broke. And of course, Frederick goes straight into the dirt. Good morning, everybody. It's only just morning. It is 10 past 11 because I got up at quarter to 11 this morning. But I don't feel bad because it's my usual routine when I fly in from doing night shift. I don't go to sleep the day before and then I sleep lots that night. Except I did go to sleep yesterday for like an hour or so. But look at Freddy. We've been trying to put him to sleep for the last 15 minutes, but he won't go to sleep. And he's probably not going to. Are you? But I don't mind because he's just sitting here doing nothing. Like a good boy. Aren't you, Freddy? You want to say anything to the camera? Amy is making me a coffee. A second one. Not a second coffee, guys, but let me tell you why. Let me explain to you why. Because, because I'm extremely tired and I need to wake up extremely quick because I've had a skip bin, a rubbish bin delivered because I'm going to do a big clean up out the back today and, and inside, Amy could do the inside, but I've got to dig out a lot of dirt and get rid of a ton of rubbish. Because we're building Freddy's Cubby House. make a start anyway yeah and as Jason comes home it's like Freddie's just forgotten I'm around I'm just like going invisible when Jason comes home hey when daddy comes home you don't even love me anymore mm. no it doesn't it's all about Jason it's all about daddy isn't it yeah. here's your coffee thank you enjoy it while it lasts Look at Frederick iron that coffee off. He's like, give me some, Dad. After fighting it for almost an hour, Frederick has finally gone to sleep. And now it is time for me and Jason to do some work outside. I know we've already had a little mishap and we've actually already broken our wheel on our wheelbarrow. Our wheelbarrow tire decided to go flat right at the start, didn't it? I have to now go to Bunnings to go get a new tire for the wheelbarrow. One is completely dead. The little like thing to pump it up is literally pulled out of this. Like it's, it's just gone missing. There's like a big hole. This is what I mean by a big hole. The little thing that goes in there to inflate it. It's literally been pulled out and the air is just coming out of it. So we need to go get a new one. Also while I'm out, I'm gonna go get myself some lunch. Don't really know. I don't really know what I'm going to get, but I'm just going to get something small so I can eat it here. Uh, I might get something for Jason, but we'll just see. Just got to Bunnings and I was looking around waiting to see the tent because at Bunnings they have like this outdoor tent area um, where they, um, you know, make sausages on like, like hot dogs, basically sausages on bread. Um, and they sell fizzy drink and everything. Bunnings doesn't have it today. What? I was like, oh, I'll get, you know, myself a hot dog for lunch, even though it's not the healthiest. It's just a sausage and bread. But I was just like, yes, that's like the thing you do when you come to Bunnings is that you get a sausage and, you know, some fizzy drink. I can't even do that because there's none here. What am I meant to do? I am appalled, absolutely appalled. I don't understand any of this hardware stuff, but I think this is the one that I need to get. I think. Just hope that it actually is the one and I don't have to come back to get another one. I'm back to the car now and I really hope I got the right one because I really do not want to come back. Plus I also don't want Jason to be like upset or angry if I've got the wrong one. 
I'm a girl. I can't do this. I just can't. I'm not like boyish in any kind of way. Also, guys, now I have to try and figure out what I want for lunch because Bunnings disappointed me. I just don't know what I wanted. I was just like, oh, I don't know what I want. And then when I was driving here, I was just like, I want one of the Bunnings um, sausages. And then I got here and it's just disappointed me. So I really don't know what um, I shall get for lunch now. I just, I just don't know. Just got back home and I'm hoping that this is the right one. I really Mr. Freddy is awake. What are you doing awake? You're meant to be sleeping. You still want to go back? What time did he wake up? Probably about 20 minutes ago. Oh, okay. So we got about an hour. <laughs> yeah. Frederick's a little bit special and he's on the kitchen bench. Yeah. Having fun up there on the kitchen bench. He's having some fruit toast for lunch. Yummy, yummy in your tummy. Yummy, yummy in your tummy. Yeah. So this afternoon hasn't gone to plan. Last time we seen you guys, I just got back from Bunnings and I had got a new tire. So once I got back and Jason was putting it in the tire, it actually already had a hole in it. So we had to go back to Bunnings and get another one. When we got another one, what happened to it, Jason? I broke it. Jason broke it. He put a screwdriver straight through it. So we haven't gone back to go get another one. So Jason has lifted everything from behind the shed by hand. He is a machine today. We have gone to Bunnings, obviously, again, and we got the wood. This is basically what we're working with. This is Frederick's sand pit. Now it is huge. I'm trying to show you guys how big the sand pit is. So I'm laying down and the sand pit goes longer than me and I'm 5'2". So it's longer than 150... Where is the standing line so far? Eight centimeters. What? It's just standing there waving at me. No, it's just cool to come over. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> so yeah, his sand pit pit is going to be absolutely huge these things aren't obviously going to be there that's part of his cubby house that is going there jason's just putting in the poles at the moment which are getting filled up with water and concrete at the moment hey anyone wants to put posts in the ground this is how you do it that's how you do it you don't put the dog's toy in there tiger silly tiger on the side. Is that just a pipe? Yeah. Frederick, no. Water. Did you guys see what Freddie did in the background? He tipped the whole bucket of water on him. He's literally soaking, like, he, oh, you can't even tell on my hands, but he's soaking. Good one, Frederick. Good one. And of course, Frederick goes straight into the dirt and gets filthy. Look, look at him. Before this camera dies and I have to go charge it, we're actually going to say good night. Frederick needs to have a bath desperately, but he's going to have it after dinner, unfortunately. So he has to stay dirty for a little bit longer. But yeah, we're going to get going for the night. Hope you all enjoyed today's vlog. We were outside quite a bit today and I actually really enjoyed it. And we're going to be outside more often because of this. So excited. So yeah, I guess we'll see you guys all on Monday. And I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Bye. Say bye-bye, Freddy. Bye-bye.